Welcome to CAP, the Clinical Information Access Portal. This video on how to use limits is continuing the search from the Boolean Operators video. As you can see, we concluded with 109 results. We could begin by limiting this search by restricting to humans. If you don't select a particular search number, Ovid applies the limit to the last search number. Click Search. This has limited our search to 101 results. See how the database has translated our limit? We could have also just typed limit 8 to humans in the search bar to produce the same result. Many people will initially limit a search to full text or English language. However, the best available information may not be available initially in full text and may possibly be in another language. These limits should only be applied at the very end of a search when it is clear that there is ample evidence for you to make these restrictions. There are many other limits available. Click on the additional limits to expand the display. As you can see, you can limit by age, animal type, and a number of other concepts. In our example, whilst the patient who has diabetes is middle-aged, using an age limit will not refine the information in a usable way. Age is not one of the core concepts we are searching. In evidence-based medicine, one of the most useful limits is publication types. You can select multiple limits within the same group by holding down the control button. We will limit to meta-analyses and systematic reviews. Once you've made your selection, click limit a search at the bottom of the page. As you can see, we have gone from 101 results to 10, all of which are high quality evidence. Limits are useful tools. If we clicked on limit to full text, we would have only retrieved one result. Let's have a look at an alternate way to limit our results. Click the box beside search statement number eight. We can use the limit clinical queries and limit search number eight to both therapy, maximizes sensitivity, and therapy, maximizes specificity. Limiting to therapy, maximizes sensitivity, only reduced result number eight from 109 to 108. Limiting to therapy, maximizes specificity, reduced result number eight from 109 to 34. This retrieved fewer relevant articles, but also fewer off-target articles. We can use the Boolean operator, not, to determine if the clinical query, therapy, maximizes specificity, found any unique results not discovered earlier in search number 10. We can find this out by typing the command 13, not 10. We have 33 results. What is interesting is that the limit found 32 unique articles. Using the Boolean logic yet again, if we combine 10 or 13, we finish with 43 unique results to consider that have been selected with evidence-based principles. Just looking at the first few titles, the results appear to be on topic and relevant. A few also appear to be available with full text. That concludes the video on using limits. We hope you are feeling a lot more confident in applying these into your future search strategies.